That's a lot of power to be concentrated in one object. You think it's dangerous? I'm not sure. Regardless, it should prove useful. Thank you again. Tanta's blessings. You too, whatever that means. How far now? Maybe you should grab an apple. An apple a day. We'll keep phrase hunger at bay. Such a poet. So, how do we get to this Cognizance's guild place? If I'm reading the peasant girl's map correctly, we'll need to leave the city by the south gate. All right, let's get going then. Hello there. Can I get you something? What's this? It's a Partha from Janoon. So they're like Athian dice? They're made of animal bones. You roll one, and if it lands on one of the little symbol things, <laughs> you're in for a lucky day. Wow. Sounds fun. Oh, that's all it is. No one takes it too seriously. Go on, give it a go. Guess it's my lucky day. So, you're guild bound, I hear. Guess you hear a lot of things. That I do. There's not a lot happens in this town I don't come to know of eventually. Huh. No idea if he can be trusted, but we might as well see what he can tell us, wouldn't you say? The Cognoscents used to study things we mere mortals couldn't hope to understand. Old Treaty used to say that one of their books was worth more than a hundred loaves of bread. That's all I get from the guy who knows everything? I told you, it's town I know about. And that place wasn't inside the city walls last time I checked. Come on, it was better than nothing. Poor chap. Horton's a bit earnest, but she's got her head screwed on. And you won't find a kinder soul in St. Paul. Granted, there are those who think she sometimes sticks a nose in where it doesn't belong. If you can add me to that list, that's for certain. But Dad, Robian, he was well respected enough that everybody knows a heart must be in the right place. Used to be a very good customer of mine, that one.
Don't you think you've had enough for one lifetime? Now that's what I'm talking about. Some complex flavors going on here. Hmm. Connoisseur, are we? All right, come on. Don't hold out on me. What's the secret ingredient? Hey, I can't tell you that. It's more than my job's worth. Well, suit yourself. Warden's putting a lot of faith in you, you know. I didn't ask her to. Oh, charming. Well, be seeing you again soon. This is the only pub in town, after all. <laughs> You like that place, don't you? Do I? Huh, I guess the vibe in there is acceptable. Oh, to be young and a familiar face at the local drinking hole. Yeah. Sucks being you. It's just up ahead. Uh-huh. Tanta's blessings. Hey on. Who the heck are you? You're not the one they're saying came from outside the city, are ya? Well, just don't go causing any mischief, you hear? Oh. It's like somebody made an entire city out of back alleys. Which makes them front alleys now, I suppose. Pray, lend me your ears. I have a fine song to play you. Very well. Then allow me to regale you with the ballad of the enormously clever person of Sipal. Is that really the best title he could come up with? Well, did it speak to your soul? Did the doleful melody conjure images of the encroaching miasma, the unearthly cries of its foul denizens? The unlucky inhabitants of this fair city, myself among them, cursed, never again to venture beyond its walls. Again? Have you ever been out there? But, of course. What manner of minstrel would I be? Did I not go wandering over hill and dale? <laughs> In my dreams, of course. <clears throat> you, Bart! Escaped criminals roam the streets and still you do not cease your racket. There is a crisis afoot. Forgive me, but there is always a crisis afoot. Well, you may have a point there, but nonetheless... She's a guard, Frey. We need to get out of here, now. I, uh, guess I'll be on my way then. Wait. You. You're... So sorry to see you go, fair maiden, but go you must. And quickly. <clears throat> that was a little too close for comfort. But we got away, thanks to the fop. Dream wanderings indeed. Yeah, and that song. What the hell even was that? Oh. Sorry about this one. He's not the bravest. It's not often we see an unfamiliar face. Where did you spring from? Aye, aye! 
But you the girl I heard about? The one who came from outside the city. What's it like out there? Come on, tell me, tell me. I want to know. Oh, wait. My mum says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. They really took the whole medieval thing and ran with it here, huh? If you say so. Yeah, except when it came to you. I mean, come on, can you be and vow it up a little bit? Gosh. Almost there. Roger that. There's even more guards out looking for me than yesterday. And Councilwoman Dax is in charge of them. Be warned, she's not to be messed with. I do pity those who were born here. Why? Because the outside world is so dangerous? Yes, they'll never know anything but this. Wow, that is a ton of junk right there. I suppose there's nowhere else to put it all if they can't leave town. That soup they served us today didn't taste of anything at all. Oh, and that rotten councilman said we'd get the same food as the upper city. A likely story. Liars, a lot of them. What's that? <laughs> Tonta's blessings be upon you. You. You are the escapee. Please, I beg of you, do not harm the children. I'm so glad they have cats in Athia, too. Why, exactly? Do you have some special attachment to the ridiculous little creatures? Huh? What? No. Miss you, Homer. A short trip. How the hell do you get out of this dump anyway? I know a way. You. You been following me, kid? No, but I know how to help you. Really? I know everything around here. Mm hmm. And what's that gonna cost me? An apple, maybe? So you have been following me. Sure. You seem hungry. Just follow me. Don't you want to know my name? Not really. It's Olivia. And you're Frey. Everyone's been talking about you. I guess I'm kind of famous around here. Does famous mean hunted by the gods? I call it finders keepers. Damn. Did you steal all this stuff? Not all of it. You're growing on me, kid. Sometimes people have no idea what they're throwing away. I often make new things out of this stuff. Here. If you get hurt, this will help you heal. All right, nice. You'll have to give me the recipe. Of course. Let me teach you how. Try it.
People really do throw a lot of stuff away, huh? Yes, a lot of useless rubbish. Wait, this might come in here. Hey, Shorty. I got you something. That thing you said, is it worth crap? No, not my cell phone. And thanks for not swiping that again. I don't steal from friends. Friends? Cool. Uh, well, as your friend, I got you this. Wow! What is that? Are you a taunter? <laughs> it's a pen light, and... No, I'm not a taunter. I... What's the deal with those guys, anyway? They were the strongest and most powerful woman in Athia. They all had gifts. But in the past, they used them to help protect the land. But one day, they will again. They'll come and save us. <sighs> Listen, kid. From personal experience, you gotta look after yourself. People only really get saved in fairy tales. You're wrong. You'll see. All right, well, uh, I got a split. Um, you said you knew the best way out of this place? Well, if you climb over that wall there, that should help you get to where you want to be. Cool. Thanks. I'll, uh, see you when I see you. I'll keep the city safe while you're gone. Sure. You do that. I think we're nearly there. Well done, me. You like cats, don't you, Frank? Me too. Kind of. A cat. I'm so glad they have cats in Athia, too. Where is it going? Flighty little creature. Worth chasing it down, perhaps? What do you want us to find here?
You let me here on purpose, didn't you? I think I'd like a surname. Something dignified. Yeah, something with a... Why don't your trust issues extend to the street urchin, I wonder? Because I've been there, all right? Let's just leave it at that. 